Hey, good fucks here. Today we have a gameplay of the new Khalil Mac. Thank you to Bengal Designs for the loan. I have his link to his YouTube in the channel. If you want to see somebody, I think he said he's going to use her Khalil Mac. Uh, I also have Wagner and Harris here. I borrowed from Shahara Joe. I'll put on another video of those guys that we're focusing on, but we're really focusing on Mac today. Uh, so we can take a look at his speed, strength, not, don't look at strength. Acceleration, tackling, play rack. We'll compare him to Clowny, I think is a good comparison. A little Clowny gets a lot more boosts because of those uh, chems that he has. But anyways, 90 speed, great. He's a linebacker that's as fast as a lot of receivers. And in fact, he's faster than a couple of receivers I run with. Block shed 97, so he should be amazing against the run. Pursuit 95, again, great against the run. Hit power 92, that's a little lower than I'd like. I'd like to see that at 97, of course. Um, you know, you always want to see stats higher than, than they are. So, uh, overall, a great, great card. Power moves at 98. So, he should be able to shed left tackles quickly on the pass rush, get home for a sack. But we'll see how it plays out. Here's my team. It's beautiful. Look at that. 99, 99, 99 on the first three. Going against a guy with a couple 97s. Odell Beckham, new one. So, pretty good squad he's got. I'm just going to show the defensive gameplay because um, I think that's all I really care about. So, Mac is the, the red star on the right of screen, kind of getting the off. He didn't get much pressure there. Kind of, how do you say, it was just pushing, I guess. Just pushing the right tackle, not really executing his moves. And I feel like he really should. He's going against Blaga here, I believe this is. Um, and Mac, what's great about it, he he's got a great uh, traits. He's going for 1.53 million at the moment. But his traits, uh, D-line spin move, yes. Big hitter, yes. High motor, yes. D-line swim move, yes. Bull rush, yes. Strip ball, no. That's too bad. But clutch, yes. So he's got all the moves. So let's. we really want to analyze, make sure he gets those moves. I'm using Wagner here. Really doesn't try and pull a move there except for maybe the bull rush. Maybe he's trying to bull rush too much with his power move because his power move is his dominant move. Maybe the finesse move. There's a failed spin. So it's not looking great against Bulaga, I think, is the 75 there. Um, there's the double team getting kind of uh, hit down on the edge. So no real pressure there. It's kind of hard to generate pressure with the natural pass rush here. Look, he's got all day in the pocket to sit there. I mean, those are some great as we force the fumble. Those are some great pass rushes, but nobody's getting through. It looks like, you know, those block sheds everybody complains about so random. They're on the run. You know, he's double teamed, so you can't really fault him for that. On the pass again, kind of getting sucked to the middle here. And I don't know why. I'm trying to, trying to do a straight four-man rush, but it's not really helping. There's a straight three-man rush, and he just got knocked over. He just got pancaked. So... Mac, it's looking like his pass rushing a little inconsistent there. Um, and, and that is something with Madden. You know, you can't get really consistent pressure unless you bring an edge heat here. Um, as we get the knock up and uh, batted down there, it finally hit the ground. Here's some edge heat, and uh, he did get the ball off pretty quick. So my opponent is getting it off quick enough um, where we, we're not getting enough natural pressure or edge pressure to really get home. Here's another three man rush. A quick throw again to the post, but we had that uh, post covered. Off the edge, it looks like he tried to get around the edge there, but no luck. So we're not having, like I said, much pass rusher. But, like, his big, uh, ooh, wow, my defense just got ran over. You know, his biggest strength is his block shed for against the run. Um, and he is running a little bit more kind of away from Mac, though. I kind of want to see some runs towards him. You'll see him. Here's off the edge of the 4-4, swerves around his running back. Not able to get home, though. The speed at 90, you know, going hard. So, I mean, like, if you match him on man coverage... Man coverage doesn't cut cover cuts this year very well, or if at all. There, uh, what was that? He got sucked inside. Didn't he have outside contain on that play? Again, here he's got outside contain. Okay, they run away from him. They run to the other side, and Harris Jr. is able to bring him down. So that car got the block shed. There he is. Um, not stuffing that. I think. Oh, okay. He hurries up. I think this next play, we get. We ended up getting a penalty, unfortunately. I mean, a little bit of a glitch here. But here it is. Watch him on the inside. He gets kind of pushed in. And collapsed down. I don't know if that was like a mistake with the D lineman got pushed down and they just couldn't, I don't know, separate from the offensive lineman. But otherwise, this this Mac, he's got like plus ones and twos from his 93. And I used his 93 version for quite a while because I pulled him out of a pack. And I liked him. There's a sack, though. There's a sack this game. So, I mean, defensive lineman, can you really ask for more than one sack a game from a defensive lineman? I don't think so. I mean, how many plays are in a game What on defense? 30? So, really... You know, he's kind of making his play. I mean, with the amount, with how quick the ball's getting out of this guy's hands, it's it's really hard. There's a failed spin from Mac. He's holding his outside contained, but uh, Shad just goes up and makes the play tremendously. Last play of the game. All right, so 
after this play, there will be footage later on the channel. Mac will be on the squad again. Got another game with him. But check out, I'm going to focus more on the user as Donald gets that safety for us. But that's it. Thanks for watching the gameplay. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, once again, shout out to Bengal for the card. All right, see ya.